zero four. nine four then press the ok key uh, by doing so you'll get rid of the nuisance arm Hello everyone, how have you been? Joa Tech here. If you are a returning subscriber, thank you for coming back. If you are new here, welcome. Feel at your own place. This is a YouTube channel where we learn through practicals. In today's video, we will be looking Hexin model 2023 CIU. CIU is a customer interface unit. Okay. It is used to load token and monitor the MCU, which is measurement and control unit. Once installation of MCU uh, is done, uh, what follows uh, immediately uh, is the activation of meter then the mounting of the CIU inside the customer's house in our recent previous videos we demonstrated how to mount a CIU uh, by use of its bracket or clip be sure to check out our previous videos one being activation and that is uh, one being installation and activation of Hexin 2023 model and the other one uh, regarding how to mount a CIU inside a customer's house. A customer is required to use the CIU to load the token or to monitor the MCU when necessary. In our today's video, I am going to show you how to interpret the information displayed in the CIU LED screen and how to use short codes when needed to. The L LCD screen of a CIU will display one data plate immediately once the CIU is powered. The information to display is credit in clothes and uh, this shows the uh, immediate you load uh, the CIU or your meter with token. The other thing to display on the screen is a contact switching whereby there is off and on. It will display off in case there is no token or the meter has been tampered. That means the uh, contact switch will be off. It will also display contact switching on. This means uh, uh, you have loaded the token. The switch will uh, connect, meaning that uh, the power has also been connected. All right? The other information, the LCD screen will display credit status, whereby it means like this. Uh, green lamp writing means sufficient credit. Yeah. And the value uh, is Barang's credit is more than Revo 1. Red lamp writing will uh, will be meaning low credit warning uh, with an alarm level one balance credit is between level one and level two red lamp flashing raw credit warning alarm level two balance credit is between level two and level three red lamp flashing and bell alarm rock credit warning 
Arab level 3. Barang's credit is less than level 3. Alright. So let's look uh, uh short codes. If you happen to be using your CIU to be precise a hex in 2023 model, uh, you notice that uh, the model is different from other models that uh, were supplied to customers by KPLC prior. Okay, but for the model 2023 and uh, 2021, uh, uh, even for the Activision is very different from other hexins. To activate a hexin 2023 model, you start by pairing uh, the CIU with the MCU and you input meter number, then you press the enter key. The next uh, uh, step after pairing is commissioning. Uh, commissioning you will enter 096 or you will input 096 then press the enter key and you are done with the activation of the hexin 2023 model the model has its own short codes which I have said is different from uh, other uh, hexins that were supplied to customers way back 2020 or the year before 2021. The short code means this. If you input 001, it will show you the meter number of your meter i repeat if you input 001 it will display the meter number to check your total active consumed energy to date input 003 then enter to check your current date input 005 to check your voltage, input 007. To check your credit balance, which is very important, you input 004. So if you input 004 or short code 004, uh, it will display your credit balance. All right. If you input 008, it will display the current. And if you have been using the CIU and immediately the CIU is below, uh, you know, 10 units, it starts flashing with an alarm. Okay? Or in this case, uh, for the CIU, uh, uh, to give you a warning whereby the alarm will be on, uh, the balance of your credit uh, will be less than level 3, or the balance of credit will be between level 2 and level 3. This will flash red lamp and the warning alarm so to cancel the nuisance alarm from your hexin CIU input or enter 094 then press the OK key uh, by doing so you'll get rid of the nuisance alarm and um, Cancelling once it doesn't mean uh, you not have to cancel next time. If you cancel once, it means that once you wrote the token again, and it will be below uh, all between level 2 and level 3, the alarm will still uh, 
you know the alarm will be still on okay to check your rust fast recharge information input 033 and to check your your sdc code enter 002 so uh among all these short codes we have three very important codes you should memorize all right one is checking your meter number two is canceling the nuisance alarm and that is taking your credit balance okay so we start by checking your uh, credit balance you input 004 then press ok or enter to check your meter number just in case you lost your meter number and uh, you'd like to purchase the token you'll go to your cau and input 001 then cau will display the meter number the other short code to be used is uh when you want to cancel the nuisance alarm you cancel. input 094 or you enter 094 then press the ok key and you're good to go okay when you need to change your meter like i said uh, nowadays you're required to buy the token either through mpesa using kplc pay bill number triple eight double eight zero uh, and then account as your meter number all use kcb method yeah so uh, when you input your token once it's provided um, through sms the token will display on your uh, CAU LCD screen uh, if it is success or if the token was loaded successfully your LCD screen will show or will display SS on the top left hand corner and that indicates successful entry if the token is not correctly entered the reject reason will be shown on the display the reason caused rejection can be the 20 digit token is not entered correctly and the cau lcd screen will display reject all the token has been used to credit meter before and this will display used okay and uh, like i said uh, before for the ciu and the mcu to work together they connect uh, through plc okay so if communication is successful the ciu lcd screen will display the correct information like connect if the communication is failed it will display failed if the cancel audible alarm with short code 094 was successfully the ciu lcd screen will display success and on your left uh, top left hand top it will display one two to ensure that your CIU and the MCU works efficiently, always make sure that your CIU is connected to the main power supply. Okay, so when you need to replace your batteries, uh, you should always take uh, precautions. And uh, what you're supposed to do is to disconnect the power supply uh, from the CIU open the cover or open the battery box and then uh, check the priority of the batteries and insert them properly okay 
that's all for today until our next uh, video uh, we say thank you for watching and remember to subscribe to our channel